All right, we're here with Flip Gordon. Now, you are in an amazing match here tonight. You have an opportunity to be the six-man tag team champions with the Young Bucks. Talk about how they've welcomed you in while others on the Bullet Club have kind of not been that, you know, receptive or keen on having any part of, you know, hanging around them. Yeah, well, at first, the Bucks didn't like me either. They were the ones who started all the harmful ribs. But then eventually they started seeing a different side of me. They saw the passion I have for the business. They saw how much I was growing and learning. And how I just wanted, I just was trying to make friends here, man. And they reached out and they decided to become friends of mine. And now I have their back. They have my back. Now I'm in a six-man world tag team championship match. Um, it's insane. on the biggest show of the year. So it's, it's come a long way from harmful ribs to championships. You know what I mean? What would it be like, what, what kind of dynamic would it be if you were the six-man tag team champions with the Young Bucks? That kind of had a little bit more attention. You'd, you'd have to be kind of part of All In, wouldn't you? Yeah, I mean, you would, you would think so, right? I would think so, too. I mean, I, how did you feel when Cody posted the Pharaoh over you? I mean, do you, think, do you think he's just trying to test you, or do you think it's tough love, or do you think he just really doesn't want you to be on an All In? I think it's a combination of the things, but I think he loves getting under my skin. I think he loves teasing me about the fact that I am not all in. And it frustrates me because you put me in a poll against a fluffy, beautiful dog, of course the dog's going to win. That's unfair. It's Twitter. People on Twitter love dogs. You know what I mean? And I've been posting a little controversial stuff, maybe about Flat Earth, Milk Before Cereal. That might get on people's nerves, but really you're going to vote for a dog over me? Help me, people. Help me. I'm trying to live a dream. I want to be all in. I don't know about the uh, I don't know about the whole milk thing because you kind of someone else took your advice and kind of made it upset Cody. <laughs> I I'm just trying to help where I can, man. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> help. That's that's the that's help quotation marks. That's what we call it these days, kids. <laughs> Talk about your evolution as I far. Oh, see. <laughs> well, so I that's fine. Hanging, brother. <laughs> Talk about the evolution of yourself in Ring of Honor. Talk about the company and yourself in this in this almost a year now that you've been here, and now you're in probably the biggest night for Ring of Honor tonight. Talk about just your evolution and of the company. Biggest night for Ring of Honor and also the biggest night in my career as well. Um, I'm teaming with the best tag team in the world. I feel like I've said that so much tonight, but it's absolutely true. They are the best tag team living today. And we have a shot at the six-man world tag team championships on the biggest show of the year. Um, I just want to go out there and show everybody uh, the passion I have. Because in the last year, I've grown so much as a performer. I've grown so much as a person. I've learned so much. But there's so much I can learn. And I'm not even close. I'm, I'm, if, you, if you thought this last year was something, this next year is going to be so much more. And Ring of Honor, same thing. They've grown so much since, since the last year since I've been here. Uh, so tremendously. Every time we go back to a city, more people, bigger crowd, um, louder, you know, better matches, better talent are wanting to come here uh, from other companies. It's, it's a good time. It's the best time right now. We're, we're changing the game, and I'm, I'm so happy, and I'm so proud to be a part of it. Give me a little scouting report on SoCal Uncensored. You know, obviously, they are the, ta the six-man tag team champions, uh, maybe have a little more experience. You, you and the Young Bucks, you never know. Maybe it's a feel-out process in the beginning. Just give me a scouting report on, on, on tonight's match. Uh, I've been watching a lot of film. Obviously, I have a lot of film to watch on two of the guys. One of the guys, not so much, but he's, also, he's still a very, very talented competitor. Um, they're tough. Um, they're very dangerous, and we're in a very dangerous match. There's going to be a lot of carnage. There's going to be a lot of – people are going to get hurt. But that's, that's what it means to become the six-man world tag team champions. To put our bodies online, to go out there and say, hey, this is what we're doing. We're putting on a show, going head-to-head -head with NXT. Why? Because we're not scared. We're doing our own thing. We don't care what they're doing. We're doing our own thing. We're worried about us. We're going to go out there and we're going to put on the best damn show that we can. Any pressure on taking that ladder match to another level? Although it's kind of maybe sometimes hard to top it because there's been so many ladder matches. How to make it the, the, the next one the best one? Any kind of pressure in that? Or are you just going in there and you know, listen, we're going to entertain and we're going to try to steal the show? Not at all because every match I go into, I try to steal the show. I always try to raise the bar. Every match I have, I never go in. I'm like, oh, I'm going to take it easy today. Never. I want, that, I want that crowd to be chanting for me. I want them to want to see me and want me to come back. And if I go half, they're not going to want that. They're not going to want that. You know, they, they're not getting their money if I do that. I want to go out there and I want to have the best match on every single card that I am on. And finally, my last question to you is, 
We asked Hangman Page what team, Team Kenny or Cody, is that the match besides your match you're looking forward to the most, finding out exactly the resolution of, 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 of who's, who's actually the leader, Kenny or Cody? I would say that that is the match of the weekend. Out of all of the shows, I don't care what company you are, that is the match of the weekend. Everybody wants to see that match. There is a divide in the Bullet Club. There is a civil war. Team Kenny or Team Cody? Whose team are you on? I'm definitely not Team Cody, let's just say that. But I'm not taking sides. Unless in the, in the next 20 minutes he gets booked an all-in, then he might be Team Cody, you never know. Listen, Flip, thank you so much, man. Best thank of luck so to you tonight. I look forward to that six-man tag team championship match between SoCal Uncensored and Flip Gordon and the Young Bucks. Wow.